protection. Everyone needs it. Well, maybe except for your parents because you wouldn't be here if they had it. But that's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about data protection. Don't get me wrong, data sharing is good. With the technology today, online sites can use your data to recommend the most handy vacuum cleaner or an appropriate program for your next Netflix and chill session with your girlfriend or boyfriend or whatever. But what happens when data is not shared responsibly? It's Detective Green. Okay, so I don't know what's going on. I can't eat, I can't sleep. It's like someone's watching me, but I don't know from where. Just the other day, right? They tried to get me to bet on horses. I don't even like horses. Why do I care if one horse comes first in a race and the other one? And those strange emails. It's like they're trying to advertise or promote what got those- And this is why we need to be vigilant with our personal data. No, 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 I don't need your dog house. I don't care how comfortable it is. My cat is fine on the sofa, thanks. Yes, cat! How did you even get this number? <sighs> oh, where do all these men come from? <laughs> insane detective because I think someone's been spreading my personal data well, they say you're the one I go to who knows everything about this will you help me please you're sitting on my thinking chair Give me your laptop. I'm going to be going through all your social media accounts. Facebook, Instagram, every email account you have. We need to find out how they are obtaining this information about you. Wait, wait they? Yes, they. They who contacted you must have obtained your information from somewhere. We just need to know W-H-E-R-E. Oh, that's gonna take all night. I need to text my neighbour to feed Empress. Does your mother know you call her that? What? No, Empress is my cat. Cat. She's probably starving now. Does this look familiar? Oh, I love Cat Lovers Magazine. Empress loves the new kitty house that we got. No, 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 my dad, don't talk. Two weeks ago, an article was published. 237 companies were found selling personal information of their customers to third-party marketing companies. Cat Lovers Magazine was one of them. What? You think that's bad? One time somebody kept calling my client non-stop for two weeks to get him to buy hair products. Wait, but that's good, right? My client was a bald 50-year-old man. Oh. You should be more careful before giving your personal information so freely. Especially without reading their data protection policy first. So, that explains Cindy's case. Don't start sharing data on the best deals and subscriptions online without checking it first. Like what I said, protection. It's so important. So important that our friend Cindy decides to share my intellect and charming personality on her blog. Cue the music! Yeah.